Hi guys, welcome to the vlog. I went to start editing this vlog together and realized Cal accidentally deleted, I'm blaming this fully on him, it's his fault. He deleted the beginning clips for this vlog. No worries though, I'll just restart it for you guys. Welcome to the vlog. In this vlog we did some shopping for an upcoming shoe, got some stuff for Cal for his birthday. It was very fun, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you so much for watching. Let's roll the clips. My golly gosh, it is hot hot outside you guys okay so cal came home from work we hung out for a little bit we actually sat in the backyard and just like caught up and i got new little like backyard chair things so we just like laid on them they're like little puff chairs they were so comfy so we just laid out now i'm finally leaving definitely a little bit later than i had anticipated but we have many places to go i want to go to i made myself a little list on my notes we need to go to target bevmo costco and home goods and then maybe like a normal grocery store if i don't find everything at costco and i don't want to buy in bulk so we've got many errands to do let's hit the road we need to start with the non-perishable things so target it is first okay first stop is target and i'm looking for some wardrobe for tomorrow's shoot but first I gotta find the women's clothes because I don't know where I am. I'm here for regular clothes, but I found this cute swimsuit and I wanna try it. I always wanted to try this style. Okay, found the clothes. So cute. Look at these little, this denim skirt is so cute. Definitely need one of these. Oh, I love that. I like the little rips in the bottom. All right, got the skirt. I picked up these little plants over here too. They're perfect to put in like pretty much anywhere in the house and they're just so little. I got a couple bikinis. I got this blue one that's so cute. I got the matching bottoms to the purple top that I already have and then this top that I just showed you guys and a new iPhone cord because mine broke. This is like a little Prada dupe. So cute and there's the little hand sanitizer holder on it. That's so fun. Last but not least, I'm looking for some jewelry. I am a silver jewelry gal, so I'm gonna try and find some. Oh, maybe some fun earrings? Just kidding, I just remembered. I can't wear earrings. I don't have the piercings yet. These are still healing. Bracelets and necklaces it is. All right, Target done. Finished that in like 30 minutes, which is pretty good for Target time. Now we're going to BevMo to get Cal some of his favorite alcohol for his birthday, because what is a 25th birthday without Alcohol. Big on whiskey and I found this one that looks like a gold bar. Cool. I'm so annoying. I just made the biggest gasp. Can you hear? They're playing The Climb by Miley Cyrus. Today is a good day. Lost for no direction. All right, alcohol secured. Got the scotch, got some whiskey, seltzers, and seltzer lemonades. We are good to go on that front. Now we're going to Costco, which literally it goes Target, Bevmo, Costco, can't make this up. Everything within a mile of each other. I love living over here now. Don't get me wrong, I miss downtown. I love downtown, but they didn't have any like big stores like this around. I had to drive at least like 20, 30 minutes to get there. So this is my paradise. Okay, Costco, let's go. I heard samples are coming back soon. Maybe they're there today, probably not, but everybody pray. On my way in, first thing I noticed, sunscreen, which we actually really need some in the house. So I'm gonna get this one and this one because Cal burns really easily and needs a uh, facial sunscreen. There we go. My queen and my king liquid IV. Oh my god, they actually have such cool stuff here. Look at that big ass. It's not a surfboard. Paddleboard? Paddleboard. That's what it is. The true confusion in my voice. You already know. I always like to look at them when I come. I really don't need any more, but I like to look. Whoa, these are big. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh. Celery for juicing. Tonight I'm really craving asparagus and potatoes and some chicken. Always gotta get avocados. Gonna get muffins for the crew tomorrow. Love me a blueberry. I like lemon poppy seed. Oh, almond poppy seed. But I think more people want chocolate, so I'll do chocolate. Here's a group of people waiting for the rotisserie chickens to come out. This turkey bacon looks bomb. I got some uncooked flour tortillas for quesadillas. Got some Parmesan cheese. Honestly, these chicken nuggets look bomb. I don't eat chicken nuggets very often, but I feel like this will be a good drunk snack or just a good snack in general. I really want the sorbet in the fruit cups. My mom used to get the island sorbet when I was a kid, but my Costco doesn't have it, but they do have this mango helada. That looks really good. <laughs> these right here are the epitome of Costco. Costco in a tub. They have so many meat alternatives now, that's awesome. And this brand of pot stickers just absolutely gave me so much nostalgia. The Ling Ling pot stickers reminds me of being a kid. 
There's so many mandus here. Ooh, tempura orange chicken. Ooh, get me away. That sounds so good. Also, these shrimp wonton ramens are delicious. I found black garlic. I don't know how to use it, but I want to try. I'm always going through garlic powder. I don't know why I didn't think to get a big one here. Look at all this baking soda. Oh my goodness. $6.99, what a deal. I've never really come down the seasoning aisle. I am inspired. I love shiitake mushrooms and they made them into this snack I need. These are bomb too, little like cauliflower bites. They've got great snacks here. All right, last couple stops. Home goods, then the grocery store. I just couldn't find a specific cheese at Costco. Home goods for Daisy stuff. Oh my God, they have my old toaster here. I loved this thing because you could see inside of it. And such a good price. I think I bought mine for like 40 or 50. What a deal. Okay, so far, haven't found anything. I'm looking for a pet food container and I saw like a couple back there but they were like kind of broken already. So we're not gonna buy those. <gasps> Heart-shaped pasta, so cute. The server has caught my eye though. This little thing's so cute. I love a bowl or just a cute little platter. Oh my god, I want to make a casserole on that. Very pretty. Oh, I like these oval plates. Cute. All right, no luck for Daisy, but that's easily something I can find online probably. Now we're getting cheese and going home. The sun is setting. It's so beautiful. Cheese time. We need candles for Cal's birthday. I'm leaning towards, I don't love the gold. White and silver. Cool. Here we go. Medium cheddar we can shred ourselves. There we go. And not a giant, giant block from Costco. Errands complete. I look like a tomato. Got a car snack. I always have a car snack, guys. <coughs> Ugh. I choked. They were so good. Okay. On my way out of the store, I grabbed these organic tropical mango. It's from this brand called Sun Ridge Farms. I've never tried this brand. Holy shit. These are so good. They're just dried unsweetened mango. Bomb. All right, let's go home. I'm gonna hide Cal's stuff so he doesn't see it. And let's have some dinner. Mm. <laughs> we are home, Cal is carving the chicken. And I am going to attempt to make smashed baked potato, I forget what it's called. But I parboiled some potatoes. Smashed uh, what? Smashed uh, something, something. I've got my asparagus that I already trimmed, ready to go. I'm gonna grill it on this pan. Actually, I can start grilling it now. I'm gonna get this pan hot. Three. Oil back there. Now, I'm going to take my potatoes and put them on this cutting board. Potato. So parboiled means that they are definitely soft, but they're not like fully, fully, fully mashable yet. They're just like fork tender. I'm gonna take a glass with like a really nice thick flat bottom and just press down on the potato like that. The thinner you get, the crispier they're gonna get. I might've actually boiled these a little too long, but they're kind of like a random size. Ooh, there we go. Ooh. Oh, that one was perfect. Either way, they're potatoes. They're gonna taste delish. Ooh, this one's good. Yes, that's what we want. I almost sliced my finger off. Be careful. Don't wanna take you to the ER tonight. Ooh, another good one. Oh, okay, the big ones are kinda hard. Okay, we will make do. Mmm, I love potatoes. I'm gonna take some spray oil. I'm gonna spray on top of the potatoes here because my tray is open and I don't wanna get the oil everywhere. Just spray the tops, and then we're going to throw the asparagus on the pan, take our spatula, scoop up our potatoes, place them on, actually I should have seasoned them first, whatever, it's fine. These, this is the perfect one. Mmm, my hand tastes like soap. Now time to season them, I'm gonna do salt, garlic powder, onion powder, dried parsley, or you can do fresh parsley, and Fresh black pepper. One more little spritz of oil all over the top. I'm making a mess. We're gonna air fry these for like 10 minutes and I'll show you guys them at the end. I'm gonna top them with a little Parmesan cheese too that I got at Costco. Woo! All right guys, dinner is complete. We've got some rotisserie chicken. We both have a little bit of a mix of dark meat and light meat. This one's mine. This one's Cal's. We've got these asparagus that I grilled up with a little bit of lemon juice, some Parmesan on top. We've got garlic powder, onion powder, salt, pepper. Potatoes are fresh out, a little bit of Parmesan cheese on top. They look so delicious. And then on top of the potatoes to make them extra special, I'm gonna add a little bit of my favorite ARs, hot southern honey. This one just adds a little bit of sweetness to it. Tiniest little bit of honey on top. And then to make it extra special, the tiniest bit of white truffle oil. Just the smallest smidge. Whoa, that was a lot. Sorry, Cal. Done. Woohoo! Very fancy dinner from Costco. Someone wants dinner. 
Someone wants dinner. Who wants dinner? You guys want dinner? <laughs> okay, dinner time. Hello all, it is the next night. It is currently 7 p.m. on Friday. I officially just finished with that big shoot that I was talking about yesterday, you guys. I have never had a shoot actually go to like from start time to end time when they say it's gonna be. It's usually like we wrap like a few hours earlier. So in my brain, I was prepped to end, I don't know, three, four, maybe five. No, we went from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. today. It was so much fun. I am gonna be an annoying influencer and tell you I can't tell you what it's about or what it was, but just know you're going to love it. It was an amazing experience. We did it all from the house and it was so funny because obviously like none of the crew could come inside. It was just me, Wit, Sarah, and Lavette. So we were doing it all, like setting up the cameras. We had like the people on the Zoom. It was such a cool experience to have a whole shoot like that. And it was so funny. I was like setting up the cameras and like setting up the shot and then like talking to them, showing different angles and like moving it around. And then I would sit in the shot and one of the guys was like, she's the DP, she's the talent, she's doing this, she's doing that. I was like, a jack of all trades today. So it was so fun. Very relieved to be done though because I am tired. For tonight, I'm going to go take my makeup off, go take my hair out, and I am going to probably take a bath, eat some delicious Postmates dinner, maybe some sushi, I'm craving sushi, treat myself, lay in bed, and watch movies all night. So yes, I will take you along with me on this night, but the house is already clean. Sarah, Witt, Cal, and I all clean up the house. It looks so beautiful. She looks brand new, look at this. Oh, also. You might be wondering, Remy, what are all these huge wooden things? So, for the past few months, I've been working with the most incredible small business ever. Their names are the Larios Project. I learned about them from my amazing friend, Kim Tai. They're a husband and wife duo, and they have their first baby along the way. They're amazing, their names are Jocelyn and Brian, and they have basically been working with Cal and I to build out closets in the house. Oh, do you need to go potty? Basically, when we moved into this house, every closet but the one in our bedroom had nothing in it, not even like a clothing rack or anything. So we've been working with them to build out drawers and shelves and things within the closet. Also while supporting an amazing small business to have more storage in the house because we have literally no storage at all. There is one closet underneath the stairs to hold like ladders and like equipment and things like that. Like I don't even have any sort of like closet for towels or sheets or anything like that. So they've been amazing. I'll take you guys on the whole journey with when they're installed. They were gonna install today, but obviously because we were filming, it couldn't be loud. So they'll all be doing it next week. Let me straighten up my new outdoor chairs that I told you guys about. They got moved over because this is where the crew was outside. Okay, one in the puff. They left tape in an iPhone charger. Hopefully someone comes back for that. Check it out. <laughs> That's the thumbnail. Oh, it's so comfortable. I could just fall asleep out here now. Hi. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Time to clean some more. Gotta pick up the dog poop. Someone likes the new chair. Hi guys, I'm in this shirt. <laughs> this is Cal's shirt. I feel like I look like I work at Hot Dog on a Stick. This is Cal's Cowboy Bebop shirt. I used to make fun of him for it, but it's actually very comfortable. Makeup is off, glasses are on to give my eyes a break. I just got these new glasses from Warby Parker. I'm trying to break them in. I lost my old glasses. I don't know where they went, but Warby Parker is great. This is not sponsored, but if you guys are looking for glasses, they're so great. I just did it online and they came in like a day or two. I'm here with the girls. It's just us, Cal's downstairs, playing some games with his friends. We're just having like a nice Friday night. I got a ton of sushi to eat in my bed. I haven't eaten in my bed. I don't know if I've ever actually eaten in this bed yet at this house, but tonight calls for dinner in bed. I know it's kind of gross, but we're doing it anyways. Also, I'm gonna watch Zoe 101. I've been catching up with it on, it's on Paramount Plus. So I've been watching that and it is <laughs> such a throwback. On that note, guys, I'm signing off. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so, so much for watching. Be sure to come back to tomorrow's vlog because it's Cal's birthday vlog and I've got so many fun things planned. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Good night. Sweet dreams to me.